I don't know why, but I've always kind of thought that an 8-bit PNG with a little bit of compression is the best quality to size ratio you can export from Blender for an image. And even worse than that, in the past, when I've been trying to do the highest quality of visual effects I can, I looked through to find something that matches my 10-bit camera. The only export option that specifically does 10-bit is DPX. And so I would export DPX set to 10-bit, and I've pretty much done that for the entirety of all of my 10-bit visual effects. For some reason, I haven't checked into EXR. I've heard of it before, but I haven't actually used it or tested it before until now. And if we set this guy to half float, and set the codec to DWAA. According to this guy, that's not a bad codec to use for compression. So if I look up some stats real quick, this is actually ridiculously small. The PNG file is 967 kilobytes. That's not too bad. The 10-bit DPX that I used to use to export all of my visual effects is 11 megabytes per frame, which is pretty chunky. And then an EXR, if we're just doing half a float, full float actually isn't even that different. It's just a couple extra tenths of a kilobyte, which is kind of ridiculous, but I don't really need that. So just going float RGB, this is only 60 kilobytes, which comparatively is so tiny. And I could have saved so much space while keeping all of my information. And I just wanted to share this with you. Maybe you've already been using it, but maybe you haven't. And maybe it's time to start. I don't know.